ओम नमो भगवते रामकृष्णाय अ गाइड टू स्पिरिचुअल लाइफ स्पिरिचुअल टीचिंग्स ऑफ स्वामी ब्रह्मानंद कंटिन्यूएशन ऑफ चैप्टर 36 हियर इन दिस एपिसोड स्वामी ब्रह्मानंद जी स्पीक्स अबाउट ग्रेस हेलुसिनेशन वर्सेस विजन एंड द वैल्यू ऑफ रिचुअल्स क्वेश्चन महाराज इज ग्रेस कंडीशनल इज कृपा conditional swami brahmanand ji replies shri ramakrishna used to say to avoid heat stroke a person uses a fan but when the gentle breeze starts blowing he stops fanning so it is with grace question maharaj how does one know whether one is having a true vision of god or a hallucination maharaj how does one know whether one is having a true vision of god or a hallucination swami brahmanand ji replies the true vision of god brings lasting bliss and the mind is aware of its validity the true vision of god brings lasting bliss joy and the mind is aware of its validity question maharaj what is the importance of mudras and the act of touching different parts of one's body while reciting different mantras during ritualistic worship maharaj swami brahmanand ji replies rituals are very helpful in counteracting bad influences on the mind rituals are very helpful in counteracting bad influences on the mind you might have noticed that sometimes your mind is calm until you sit for meditation and that it suddenly becomes restless with bad thoughts once it happened to me seeing me from a distance shri ramakrishna understood my condition as soon as i reached him shri ramakrishna said i see a worldly thought is disturbing your mind as soon as i reached shri ramakrishna he said i see a worldly thought is disturbing your mind saying this shri ramakrishna touched my head and repeated something inaudibly within 5 minutes that worldly thought disappeared from my mind when the mind reaches the higher plane of consciousness no bad influence can touch it swami brahmanand ji says when the mind reaches the higher plane of consciousness no bad influence can touch it question maharaj isn't it extremely difficult to pass the time only in practicing japam and meditation isn't it extremely difficult to pass the time only in japam and meditation swami brahmanand ji says why should you give up just because you fail a few times try again and again it becomes easy through repeated practice swami brahmanand ji assures all of us why should you give up just because you fail a few times try again and again it becomes easy through repeated practice that is the end of chapter 36 om shanti 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 hari om tat sat shri ram krishna arpanamastu